the inspiration for this film come from? Uh, you know, this is uh, one of the few films that was really inspired by an image. You know, I had this image of this Marine who finds this photograph. And then from there you start spinning out, hmm, how can I make an interesting story about this? What happened? So it's a, it's a conscious process of, of picking and choosing when plot elements, character elements, and all of that. With that said, I live in eastern North Carolina, and I'm surrounded by the military, so it's very ubiquitous mm -hmm. to, my, to my region. Mm -hmm. And you know, I see these, these young men who go off, and then they come back, they go off, and they come back. And you really want to see, and I see who they are in their regular lives, and I really want to show you the, the nobility, the integrity that I see on a daily basis. So it was kind of a combination of, of these two things. Was the image a mental image, or was it a physical image you'd seen? It, you know, it, it, was, it was a mental image that I'd seen. It, it, it was crazy. <laughs> okay, it's got its roots in a crazy <laughs> story, but I had a picture of my wife in my wallet, you know, okay. 20 years ago, and it fell out. I don't know how. It was at work. So next thing I know, it's on the billboard at work, and the manager's like, oh, yeah, here's my girlfriend. I'm like, give me the <gasps> picture of my wife, right? <laughs> so he found this photograph. And so I, I you know, so I, I get that's the roots of it. So imagine someone finding this and, and saying, who is this person, right? Who is this person, and, and why do I need to find her? And so it's the, the creative process, bits and pieces from everywhere. It was in the morning after a night raid. <laughs> I just found it. Like I was meant to. I promised myself that if I made it out, I would find that girl and thank her for saving my life. I'm Beth. Logan. And what brings you to Hamden? It's kind of a long story. There's a man here who came to apply for the job, and I can't get rid of him. How'd you get him to leave? I gave him the job. You don't know anything about him. Neither do you. Who's that? That's just somebody that Nana hired. Night all. Do you like Jambalaya? Ben, I'm sure that Logan already has plans. I can't remember the last time I had a plan. <laughs> as clean as it'll ever be. <laughs> you think I don't know what's going on around here? You don't have a say anymore. It's just a casual beer between co-workers. It's not a date. There's something that I've been meaning to tell you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't find the right words. Shit! Ah! Hey, that's my son in there, too, you know. Let go of my arm. You should do as she says. You don't know what I'm dealing with. I do know that you deserve better than this. You stay the hell out of my life. You should be kissed every day, every hour, every minute. Where did you get that? Your boy Logan had it. I should have told you. I tried. I didn't know how. He just shows up here with something so personal. I just don't smell right to me. I think he was meant to find that photo. I think it could happen for a reason. How do you explain something that you can't even understand yourself? Why did you come here? To find you.